Where there is love, there is life. Gandhi. Hey everyone, welcome to Quotes You Need to Live By. I'm John Timmerman. This quote from Gandhi comes from one of my team members, uh, Kino. His real name's Marcos, but we call him Kino. And uh, it's such a relevant, simple quote that we all lose sight of on a daily basis. And in America, in our hard charging world, in our success, 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 make money, make money, you know, build the life that I want, see it my way, judgmental, you know, just the, the and I don't mean to say society is negative, but when there's so much negativity in the media and in social media that is available for us to see, it is hard to eat the food that is realizing that where there's love, there's life. And, and we, we're so used to putting up walls as human beings that it's extremely tough for us to realize that love is the basis of life. A few podcasts ago, I, did a, I uh, focused on a quote by Tony Shea, which was the four pillars of happiness. Uh, and one of those pillars was community. And whether your definition, regardless of your definition of love, when you talk about a community that you're passionate about, there's a level of love there. You have a love for your neighbor. You have uh, some connection with them. You, you have some commonalities with them. There's some aspect of love. And that community could be as close as your spouse, your kids, your loved ones, uh, where you share blood with them. Or it could be as far as just your neighbors or an organization that you're in. And this quote by Gandhi is so true because uh, if there's a level of connection and love there, it, it breeds life. It, uh, it spawns ideas. It spawns connection and happiness and laughter uh, and progress. And, and that's all part of life. So uh, such a powerful quote by Gandhi. Thanks, uh, Kino, for sharing it. Uh, and I encourage everybody out there to try to remember that where there is love, there is life. And if there's an absence of love, it's going to it's going to be really hard for you to identify that progress and uh, satisfaction and happiness that you're going to need to build a great life. Like and subscribe if you found this podcast valuable.